Queer theory is essentially an approach to redefining the boundaries of what it means to be straight or gay or male or female. It is one of the most relevant topics we've discussed in class to today's world, as social acceptance and progressive social views are going rapidly widespread, and the laws are even beginning to reflect that, with, of course, the big decision that gay marriage is now legal in all of the states. Uh, queer theory trusts that every set accompanies its own vital attributes. One very big controversial issue that has been going on for a while involves the famous Olympic winner, Caitlyn Jenner. As I'm sure everyone must know by now, Caitlyn Jenner was originally Bruce Jenner. Bruce decided after many years that she felt that she was a woman. Uh, Bruce changed her sex to female and became Caitlyn Jenner. I think that Caitlyn has received some good and some bad reception from her transgender decision. Uh, she's sort of a paragon of the queer theory of today, or her situation is a paragon of the queer theory of today. Uh, queer theorists feel as if gay, gay, lesbians, or transgendered individuals ought not to be arranged with scornful terms, but uh, rather with one uh, typical term that binds them all together, which is queer. And it's, according to the book, the, the queer was decided upon for both its playfulness and its shock value and its sort of insistence that whoever hears it or uses it or whatever the case may be, sort of is forced to face their conceptions of what that means. Uh, queer theorists, by and large, were extremely happy, happy with Caitlin's choice and stand behind her 100%. Non-queer theorists ultimately disagree with Caitlin's sex change. Uh, Caitlin received the Woman of the Year Award because she is seen as a hero for taking the courage to be who she really is and come out of the shell in which she has been living. Um, some people argue that Caitlin is not a true hero because she hasn't done anything but change her gender. Some people in the middle argue that it's great what she has done to be who she really is, but that, that doesn't change the fact that that person that got that transformation was not a great person to begin with. On one of Joe Rogan's podcasts, he discusses how he thinks it's wonderful that she has been able to become who she really is, but that doesn't change the fact that She's a terrible person, according to him. And it wasn't but a few months before her transformation that she allegedly uh, killed someone in a DUI. So, uh, Caitlin has received um, a lot of hate from people who don't agree with transgender people in general. Um, there are many Christians that argue God doesn't make... Uh, a person with the body of one sex and the gender of another. That he would not mess up as as it were, according to the people who believe that. 